Yo, what's good, YouTube? It's the king of the comeback, the king of the chase down. The yeah, king yeah, of the yeah. Get into the game already, son. Yo, it's bad enough you only gave him one highlight from the first quarter. But now you only got four minutes to work with, and you're gonna go on spending three and a half of them bragging about yourself? Get into the gameplay before they cut this off. My bad, my bad. You're right. I'll admit it, you're right. And a matter of fact, a lot of these people here may have seen me from either being my subscribers already, you may have seen me on GFS in the past, or maybe just being to the general 2K community, you guys have come across my page at one point or another, or my name on another page. I don't know, you might have seen me basically. And if you've been to my page before, you probably know that I love throwing off backboard alley loops to myself. Alright, this is a quick story right here. Back when the demo first came out and I made my video on day one, just like everybody else, people were telling me that I was probably the very first. How did he make that shot? I have double contested, bigger, I don't know, whatever. Anyway, a lot of people told me that I was the very first person they've seen throwing off back foot alley oop in the game. You know, so the demo was at the time, and I don't know if it's true or not, but I did it a bunch of times almost every single game, so. I continue to do it today, I love it, I think it comes out way too much, but hey, don't bite the hand that feeds you. Now this is my mod team that you guys are looking at, I have a mod player who is pretty impressive for a guy who's not even a 90 rating yet, and if I make it to the second, third, fourth, fifth, whatever how many rounds there are, you guys will most, most likely see him do what he does, he's very unique, he pushes the limits, and I could explain it, but you guys really will understand it so you come by my page and see it. But what you're watching here is my mod team series. I got a pretty humble mod team. I haven't got a single goal player in five months. This is not intentional. And I just have I just I haven't been lucky. I've been opening packs like crazy. I've earned over 200,000 VC. That's one of the main reasons why my mod player isn't a 90 yet, because I spent my VC on my team. I just haven't been lucky. But hey, sometimes you get Shaq in a bronze pack, sometimes you get crap in a gold pack, so. That was a nice spin move to the dunk. No one else is in the lane. What else do you guys expect to happen there? But fortunately for me, I've always been a pretty solid 5-on-5 five -five player. So this is back in the days when I was dominating the 2K11 Virgin Gaming Tournament. All the way up to this whack my team. I still make things happen. And check this out. I don't know if that was a flop. I don't know if that was an ankle breaker. I don't even care. I was just like, oh my goodness. I was just dying. I shot it the second I saw that happen. <laughs> Yo, I don't know if him and T-Mac used a buy one, get one free coupon at the ankle store or something but he need to take those back and that was a nice deal by my center brendan wright and then to add insult to injury my goodness that man has hops it's official lightning guys can jump there i said it and check out this super cheesy super illegal screen by harris that wasn't even a screen that was more like a football block he just grabbed him and pushed him out the way ah just the way coach taught us in practice and excuse me austin rivers coming through he pushed little man out the way, dunked on his friend, stepped on him, and kicked the ball away all because he's a D-bag. I don't know why he waited so I was right in front of him before he decided to inbound the ball. Maybe he wanted to see another off the backboard alley-oop and didn't know how to do it, but hey, if he's going to help me go up by double digits, I'll take that. And even though this is only the third quarter, I'm pretty known for my clutch. I really, really, rarely ever blow leads. I'm the king of the comeback, not the king of the choke. So... I'm going to go on to win this game, but I want to go out with the unique style of alley-oop. <laughs> I bet you didn't see that coming. I really did it. So yeah, we won this game. We moved on to the next seed. You guys want to find out what seed I'm in today. You got to come by my page. And you, you guys know how the whole process works. You come by, you click the subscribe, you watch the video too, and then you leave a comment. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I don't think anybody was expecting me to play 2K13, but here I am. I'm a Madden commentator entering new territory in NBA 2K13. What's up, guys? I'm Anthony from Team One Sound. We'll be using the Houston Rockets as a face off against the Big Lebowski. He's going to be using the Chicago Bulls. And what's so dangerous about the Chicago Bulls is their number one defense. They have a very lethal defense, and they can stop a lot of shots. They can block a lot of them, and hopefully, we can use our three point shooting to that advantage. James Harden is a very good three point shooter, and Jeremy Lin is going to move around inside the paint and hopefully bounce it off the James Harden later in this game. A shake on the play, he's gonna try a layup inside the paint. That's not gonna happen when Boozer is gonna rebound it. Now Joakim knowing to Heinrich, and Heinrich is wide open. Heinrich shoots for the three, gets it in for three points, five to zero. Chicago Bulls, Houston needs to score, but they cannot score with Omar Sheik. So now the Bulls trying to shoot for another one, and they cannot get that one in. So Patrick Peterson giving off to Chandler Parsons. Parsons wide open, he's gonna try the three, gets it in, and look at that, we're back in the game, but later 
in this first quarter. There's 29 seconds left to go. 16 to 18, Chicago Bulls. We're going to try to come back. Is she giving off to Tony Douglas? Douglas with the three. He gets it in for the swish. It's the end of the first quarter, but the start of the second, 16 to 11 for the Chicago Bulls. And now James Harden is going to try to come back in this game with the three. Hand in his face, and he still gets it in. Nice three from James Harden. But the Bulls answer back with their own three, 19-14. Chandler Parsons trying the three here. He cannot get it. But Patrick Peterson, offensive rebound. He puts it back up. Two points on that shot, 19-16. Bulls are still in the lead. Now giving off to Bellinelli. Bellinelli throwing back. Can he shoot it for the three? Yes, he can. And three points for the Bulls. Houston Rockets back and forth battle with the Chicago Bulls. They're trying to come back. And now look at this fast break. Is she giving off to Jeremy Lin? And Jeremy Lin goes in for the dunk. Look at that on top of the Chicago Bulls defense. Bellinelli giving off to Boozer. Boozer manhandling a defender in the paint. And he gets the two. 24-20. Jeremy Lin back and forth battle. 24-22. Houston slowly coming back from this. 26-24. Muhammad giving off to Boozer. Boozer gets it in for two. 28-24. That's the end of the second quarter. And the start of the third. Now Hamilton giving it off to Boozer. Wide open shot gets it in 32 26 are they pulling away with this one James Harden on the tough shot does he make it yes he does 32 28 what we needed to do now is stop them from shooting and look at that as she says get out of here and now she giving it off to Chandler Parsons Parsons to Jeremy Lin and Jeremy Lin goes in for the layup nice layup from Lin 32 32 it's a tie game and look at that we get the turnover Parsons to the beard the beard slams it down for 2 34 32 we are in the lead now with two minutes 10 seconds left to go but look at that ridiculous three point shot 35 34 they're right back in this one Harden pump fake down for the dunk look at that 36 35 Tony Douglas with the 341 35 will eventually lead to a 43 40 lead in the fourth quarter but James Harden nice little layup there 45 40 Chicago Bulls are down can they come back from this but no they can't they missed the shot now Jeremy Lin gets the and one 47 44 later in this quarter now James Harden tough shot and he still gets it in it looks like he got smacked in the face there but the beard Overcoming that little obstacle and look at this a three from the beard 52 44 and looks like the dude had to be a bum and leave Well, I hope you guys enjoyed watching the Springs match. I'm team one signing. I'll be signing out